It's all about Jim. Just to help us out on this, to follow up on Jordan's question, you praised China in the past. So what's changed when you tweeted, China's been working very hard to contain the coronavirus. The U.S. greatly appreciates their efforts and transparency. Uh, yeah. it, it will all work out well. What has changed between then, when you were saying those things about China, and now? Well, what's changed is the following. We did a trade deal, and everybody was very happy. There's nobody ever been tough on China like I've been tough on China. I got elected, at least partially, because of borders and military and different things. But one of the things I'd say is how China and other countries are ripping us off. So recently, we signed a trade deal with China a number of months ago. China is buying billions of dollars worth of our product, our farm product and other product, manufacturing product, and it's been a great deal. But then we noticed a virus, and it's not acceptable what happened. It came out of China, and it's not acceptable what happened. And now what we're doing, Jim, is we're finding out how it came out. Different forms. You know, you've heard all different things. You've heard three or four different concepts as to how it came out. We should have the answer to that in the not-too-distant future, and that will determine a lot how I feel about China. But when I was, of course, I was very rough with China. I mean, Biden, as an example, the previous administration, they let China rip off this country like nobody's ever ripped off this country. Now, what I did is I took that, I took that, Coronavirus. Jim, I took that and I made it into a great deal for our country. But after that, all of a sudden, we heard there's a virus, and a virus is coming in. That changes my mind very greatly. That's a whole different thing. So you can have good trade deals. That was earlier on, the trade deal. I made the trade deal earlier on. And it's a great deal. We're, we're taking in billions and billions of dollars of money in different forms, including the fact that we have a 25 percent tariff on $250 billion. It's a tremendous amount of money. Some of that money I've give, given to the farmers because they were targeted by China. And I gave $12 billion, I gave $16 billion, and this year we're going to be given, giving approximately $19 billion to the farmers. But — Well, something happened. Something happened. I don't say misleading or not. I'll let you know that. I mean, I'll be able to give you that answer at some point in the hopefully not-too-distant future. But I will tell you, you take a look at what happened to this world. A month and a half, two months ago, we had the strongest economy in the history of the world, and all of a sudden, I have to close the economy. I have to close the country. So we've had tremendous death and tremendous sorrow and sadness, and nobody's ever seen anything like it. And so have most of the countries of the world. Most think of that. Most of the countries. 184, you tell me. It's probably low right now, because I've been saying 184. 184 countries, uh, they've suffered tremendously. Uh, it's uh, something that is going to have to be dealt with. Going to have to Mr. President, on